Australia, a country that holds some of the most unique ecosystems on the planet. Its variety of plant and animal species allow Australia's natural environment to thrive. The bird life is even more spectacular, containing hundreds of diverse bird species like the beautiful rainbow lorikeet, the yellow-tailed black cockatoo, the galah, and the very cheeky butcher bird. But no matter what type of bird species there are in Australia, they all have one thing in common, their importance to maintaining a healthy ecosystem that we call home. The tropical rainforests of southeast Queensland are among the most abundant ecosystems. Many of our bird species play a crucial role in plant reproduction by dispersing seeds or nectar. The kookaburra, a native species, is commonly known for its cheeky laugh, but they also assist in maintaining population levels of their prey such as worms, other small birds, crickets and beetles. Kookaburras are very friendly animals you'll particularly find them in woodlands or open forest. Our native bird life helps sustain our environment, controlling plant reproduction and recycling nutrients back into the earth. Not only that, but they signify the possibility of freedom to soar. We learn that they are not so different from us. Birds have the ability to problem solve, they form special bonds, and most of all, they are very protective parents. But what if these feathered gems disappear? The trees will be silent. The rainforest landscape would undergo severe changes because there would be no seed dispersal. Nectar plants would fail to reproduce without our pollinator bird species and insects would overpopulate. One of the biggest environmental issues facing southeast Queensland is deforestation. Many of our native birds are threatened by increasing urban development. Only 18% of Queensland's tropical rainforests are protected. Deforestation poses a major threat to our bird life and their environment. Land clearing is the main cause of biodiversity loss. The impacts of humankind, not just on our bird life, but on the forests as well, are severely substantial. Bird habitats become fragmented, which means they become more vulnerable to predators. Their food sources become limited, and hatching processes are disrupted because of human activity. Once birds are gone, it affects the forest's ability to recover without proper seed dispersal and pollination. So what should we do as a bird-loving community? Bring native birds to your backyard with a simple bird bath or feeder. Your feeder should have a perch for birds to sit on, a roof for protection and enough room for them to walk around. Decorate your garden with some native plants like the willow bottle brush, grevillea and banksia. These plants will draw in many bird species and will make your yard look magnificent. It's important that the whole community should get involved in bird conservation. You should keep close contacts of your local animal or bird rescue and find information on what to do if you find an injured or distressed bird. Contributing to the protection of these beautiful animals ensures that people, young and old, will enjoy interaction with our feathered friends for generations to come. Remember, we must protect our eyes of the sky.